What's going on, YouTube? Are you having issues with using your Rolo printer with Shopify? Are your prints coming out larger than the size of your shipping labels? Something like this? Well, stay tuned. I'm going to show you how to fix that. Uh -huh. So here we are. We're already on the Shopify website. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to immediately scroll down to settings. Once you go into settings, you're going to go into shipping and delivery. Okay. So uh, what I have done is cut a little bit off because you guys don't need to exactly see my address. So <clears throat> we're going to go to the uh, label formats and what under label formats there's going to say thermal four by six inch print test label so if you're using a, a safari um, to navigate through shopify it's going to automatically prompt you to print but you'll still be able to correct the miscommunication between your rollo and Shopify uh, when it comes down to printing this actual label okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit print okay and I like to have mine at the four by six you'll see that there's all kind of paper sizes but I like mine at the four by six and a half excuse me uh, even though it's supposed to be four by six then what you're gonna do is you're gonna look for scale so if you're using Safari it's gonna show scale somewhere there okay you look for that and what you want to do is change it that percentage should be at a hundred percent so for this one we're gonna do custom scale and I'm gonna drop this down if you look at the image you'll be able to see that this image has now decreased and diminished in size so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave my image at around 97 percent well now it's getting that number and it's getting the Shopify symbol or uh, address and everything that you need okay and then you simply hit print I will not be printing because I am running out and short and low on my labels so that's it YouTube so like comment subscribe um, if you want more information like this uh, <laughs>